We have a question today about finding the shape I want from the book. It's so frustrating that I want to give up on my Cricut. Hi, this is the Creative Crafters Podcast. I'm Bet from Bet's Makes, and this is your questions answered. Now, this is an interesting one, finding the right shape from exactly what you want. Believe it or not, when you're in design space, you have the choice of 20 different shapes. Now, there are 20 of them that you can use. Now, you can combine any of those shapes and make almost anything you want. And you're going to do it all through things like combining, which is subtract, exclude, weld. So you can do your shapes that way. So if, even if I took something like a heart and I wanted to make a, a flower shape, I could unlock the heart and elongate it. So I have a nice long heart type thing. And then, of course, I could lock it in place, make a copy of it, and that's really important that you can make a copy. And then, of course, from that copy, you can rotate it. So you can click on the rotate just above. So if you wanted to go uh, 22.25 degrees and you had the original one, then you can put them toe to toe and make them all the way around. And when you're finished, you can simply weld them all together into a flower shape. So you don't need to find the shape for the flower. Everything is there for you. Now other shapes such as uh, they've got a half moon, you can make a quarter moon the same way. You can simply just grab your moon and create that quarter moon simply by duplicating your moon. And once you've duplicated the moon, you can make it a little bit smaller and then all you need to do is just push it into place where you want to have it. And that's the real important part. And simply from there, you just select both items. You can go to your combine menu and subtract and see what you get from there. And then you're going to get something totally different. Remember, it is the top one that is sliced out of the bottom one. Or you can select them both and simply slice it and that will give you a brand new shape as well. So you can play around with the shapes. There are 20 of them. Just so think of combinations of how you can put one on top of the other. Not finding the shape somewhere else, yes, it can be frustrating, but if you can create your own, that is the absolute best way to go. This is the Creative Crafters Podcast and your questions answered.